So hello guys and welcome to another quick tip. This is Leon Noodles GFX and today we're gonna be making an edge softness in Blender. So edge softness is where the edges of your picture are kinda a bit blurry. And yeah, you can also do this in Blender. You don't have to use After Effects and Magic Bullet looks for this. So I'm back in my um, vignette scene and if you didn't watch the vignette tutorial you can go uh, back to this tutorial. Um, there's a link in the description and yeah I made this quick scene. So here I have a sample image you will use your um, your scene, your what is it, uh, render layer um, input instead and yeah let's get started so I will add a uh, blur node you need to use Gaussian this time and then check variable size also check relative now you, you can blur it I'm gonna check aspect correction so this will be our blur at the edges and until now it's blurring everything and if we use our vignette as you can see as an input into the size of our blur node then you can see that everything is blurred except for the edges so we just need to invert our vignette is a color invert node and drag it in between I, no 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 I don't want it to be in that frame no. um, well so add a invert node yeah and you can barely see it yeah if I may turn it up to 15% which will take some time to render then you will see that everything is blurred because our vignette isn't really good so if we turn it back to about 3% and turn Actually, I'm gonna use another blur for this. Uh, change th this output in here. Then make it about 25%, so our center should be perfectly white. And then it is blurring the edges. Yeah, you can see it really good that those particles here are really blurry but those in the center are uh, clean and sharp and yeah that's it that's how you can make an edge softness in blender really fast and easy so make sure to uh, like subscribe if you want to see more of those tutorials and comment if you liked it or still have any questions